So this lesson is about Mississippi hot dog and Mississippi hot dog is a way that I use to, um, a term that I use to explain a particular rhythm that I use with my students. Um, some people say pepperoni pizza, Mississippi river, and it's to get our eighth notes in our quarter notes. So let's discuss what, which one is. Our quarter notes are our one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So that's our whole those. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So when we're counting those, we are using our numbers. And we want to think one, two, three, four. So when we're tapping that way, we can also divide that beat up in half. And that's going to give us our eighth notes. One, two, three, four. One and two and three and four and. And that's how we divide them directly in half. One and two and three and four and. So if we play that with our bow, we can do either half bows right here. We can do half bows on this side, the upper half of the bow. Or we can do this middle third, one and two and. So let's try that, one and two and three and four and. And let's try it just mid bow. So just this mid third here. Ready and D, go. One and two and three and four and. One and two and three and four combine these two, if we wanted to combine our eighth notes and our quarter notes, we have to really think about how we're going to divide our bow. So Mississippi hot dog is four eighth notes and two quarter notes. So we have a one and two and three, four. I always encourage my students to know the counting of it with the numbers and syllables to help us subdivide properly. But it's much easier sometimes to say our little sayings to get our rhythms in our head or just to reference which rhythm we want to play. So with our Mississippi hot dog, we are going to do half bows and whole bows. So one and two and is going to be our half bows. One and two and. And then we have three, four as our quarter notes, three, four. So you can air bow this, one and two and three, four. I flip my bow over, kind of using a very loose bow hold like this. One and two and three, four. One and two and three, four. So let's try this on our open strings. Let's do just D first. Ready and go and one and two and three four. So you can think of it that way or Mississippi hot dog. Mississippi hot dog. So let's try on each of our strings. Let's do G D A E and we're in Mississippi hot dog, Mississippi hot dog, Mississippi hot dog, Mississippi hot dog. Ready and go and just open strings for quite some time so that we are dividing our bow up properly and then we can start doing it with scales because we like to practice our scales a lot and because we have those fingers right on those tapes open one two three open one two three and then backwards so Let's do our G major first, just one octave G major. And keep in mind, we're doing half, 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 whole, whole. G major, ready and go and. <laughs>
let's try that on our D major. A D major are the, is the same fingers. D, one, two, three, A, one, two, three, and backwards. So D, E, F sharp, G, open A, B, C, D, C, B, A, G, F, E, B. Mississippi hot dog, one and two and ready, go. <laughs> Mississippi hot dog a little bit different for our A major. I would like to do Mississippi stop stop and it's not too much different. I just want to staccato our quarter notes at the end and so we're just putting space in between those quarter notes. So it's Mississippi stop stop or one and two and three Four. So let's try that three times just on our A string. So we're just going to have our bow stop between our quarter notes. Ready and go in. <laughs> that with our A major scale. Open, one, two, three, open E, one, two, three, and then backwards. So that's A, B, C, D, open E, F, G, A, and then backwards. One and two and ready, go. <laughs> help you with this, make sure you do lots of open string practice so that we make our bow arm to be very automatic so that we don't have to think about our bow as we're doing our fingers at the same time. Remember, practice makes awesome.